Hi, I'm Michelle. And I'm Tom. And we're going to talk through with you how an ADCP works. An acoustic Doppler current profiler, ADCP, measures currents throughout the water column with sound using the Doppler effect principle. The Doppler effect is the frequency shift of sound waves when there's relative motion between the source of the sound and a receiver. We experience this all the time when our ears receive sound from a moving ambulance. That means that when the ambulance is moving towards us, the sound waves are higher in frequency than when they're moving away. An ADCP works by transmitting pings of sound out into the water column from its transducers. As these pings travel, they scatter off particles in the moving water that reflect back to the device. The scattered signal is Doppler shifted, which refers to the frequency difference between the sound waves sent out by the profiler and those it receives back. And it's this frequency difference that's used to calculate the water velocity at the location of the particles. The return time of scattered sound waves relates to distance from the instrument, with later time returns corresponding to more distant water. So, by measuring this with Doppler shift, an ADCP can measure current speeds throughout a water column, i.e. a profile of current measurements. To get a three-dimensional water current profile, returns are combined from a minimum of three beams. Origin 600 has five beams for error correction, redundancy, and for applications that have a specific use for the vertical fifth beam, such as waves. Hopefully you found this video useful today. If you've got any questions, please get in touch.